call with basically just vampire books this time because a lot of books. <laughs> so, first one is a spoof one of the Twilight series, but this one is very specifically Twilight. <laughs> and it specifically says a parody. So, this will be the second Twilight parody book I have. Because why not? Twilight sucks, so why not mock it with hilarious parody books? And then we have My Wicked Vampire, which is... Well, it's, it's probably a romance book, <laughs> which I don't usually go for, but if there's vampires in it, then I like it. <laughs> it's the best way to sucker me into something, is make it about vampires. Then I basically got the entirety of the Vampire Kisses one. So there's the first one, the second one, third one. And the fourth one. So, I don't know if there's any more than just four, but I basically just got one through four right off the bat. Which was actually, this is actually on my list to read. Again, it's another probably romance book, but again, vampires. They suck me in. And there's this revamped one, which is apparently the sequel to Staked, which I don't know if I own or not. I probably don't. Then I got uh, Misguided Angel, which is a Blue Bloods novel. I have Blue Bloods, so got lucky and got one of the books from the series I don't already own. And if my memory serves me, it's a vampire novel. <laughs> so then I got Teeth, which is like a vampire novel collection from a bunch of different authors. Holy Black is one of the authors in here, which is the only name I recognize. And the only reason I recognize Holy Black is because. I fucking hated the Black Cat book by Holly Black. That book was god awful. Then I got the Morganville Vampires Volume 4. I've read part of the first book of Morganville Vampires and I was not impressed. So the only way I'll buy the rest of the books in the series is if, uh, if I can get them for dirt cheap. And I also got Volume 2 Morganville Vampires as well. I believe I already own the first volume and the third volume, so those are the only volumes I'm missing. <laughs> and then I got Vampire Nation, which is, to my knowledge, it doesn't look to be an actual novel, more as just a, here's some reading bits about vampires. And then I got one of the books I was missing from my sister, The Vampire, Lucky Break. There's a lot of books in the series, and I have quite a few of them, but bookstores don't sell them anywhere. <laughs> so, then I got the Ruby Circle, which is a Bloodlines novel. So, and I, I already have Bloodlines and the Golden Lily. There's a few I'm missing from the series, but again, I won't actually pay full price for those books. And then this book, which also looks to be a parody, <laughs> Jane Bites Back, which, yeah. Very, very obviously a vampire novel. So. Huzzah!